Hello everybody, what is up? It's Code 4 Gaming. We're back here in not emergency response today, guys. We're checking out Flashing Lights. This is a game I came across on Steam uh, the other day and I decided to purchase it. I thought it might be it looked really good. So we're gonna be starting. We've got three options for a starting point. We've got uh, City, Cod Town, and Beach Town. We'll be probably starting in City today. That looks the best, I think. And we've got a customizable character here. Well, we've got, so we've got female and male. We'll start with male. Uh, I think we'll go with that one. Uh, that uniform. Uh, I don't like the white uniform. The badge looks weird. That's better. And we'll give it the classic hat. Reminds me of the NYPD uh, uniform they have there. Sunglasses off. I think we'll leave it off. Uh, face mask. Obviously, we've got to have that on, guys. Protect us from that COVID virus. Uh, no, we'll leave that off today and head, uh, head in. So this is kind of like ERLC in the sense that there's uh, customizable cars, uh, AI calls. Uh, there is a, you can play this uh, a multiplayer or single player. I'm just in a, uh, my own server at the moment. And you've got fire department, police and EMS. And a bunch of uh, different things you could do. So I played this a bit before just to check it out. So we're going to respond to that. I think click Y. Alright, so here is our... Alright, so select vehicle. Got our vehicle selection here. Oh, sick. Now, I've, I know they had a few cars, but we have actually a lot here. We've got seven different options. We've got the Crown Vic, uh, the classic Crown Vic. I think this is one of the sedan, Falcon Interceptor. Uh, SUV, or S SUV, SSV. I'm going off the... Hey, there's the van. <laughs> And there's also a police tow truck, which is kind of cool. We'll stick with the classic Crown Vic for today, guys. Uh, we'll be running with that on our patrol. So we are looking for a shoplifter. So a uh, possible... Oh, didn't let me run down the stairs. Looking for a possible suspect. Uh, talk to staff, find the shoplifter and arrest them. Return the stolen goods. So we are... Oh, we got a gun. That's right. Oh, there's a Glock. M1911, I don't know. Also a taser, so we can still go around with our classic tase. <laughs> um, we do have a couple other options in the back of our trunk or our boot. Uh, I'll be, we'll be showcasing that a bit later. We'll jump in our patrol car here. Get our engine on, we'll uh, pull out. So we're on the lookout for a suspect. Oh. We're going to be nice and let her cross, though. I'm going to honk her. Hurry up! Jeez. Uh, we'll pull out here and see what's going on. Just pulling out now. I've just noticed a person running across the street near us. Now, this might be the shoplifter. I'm going to just uh, line him up here. Oh, he's running behind the car. Sir, stop. Stop. Police. Taser out. Taste. Suspect down. Oh, he is down. All right, roger that. Uh, let's uh, talk to him. <laughs> After tasing him, we'll ask him for him. we got Lauren Guerrero. I don't know how to say that. Uh, we we'll just get him to follow us. Follow us up. Thank you very much. Uh, dispatch show us uh, responding to a... What is this possible shoplifter suspect? Uh, suspect? Uh, yep. Let's give him a quick search there. Just make sure he's got uh, no items on us that he can uh, pull around and hurt us with. Just the stolen items and the good old ID card. Very good. Uh, we'll grab those items and we'll be able to return them to the store. Give him a quick alcohol test there. Just make sure he's not under the influence of anything. Uh, lock him up there. Oh, didn't mean to bring the torch out. Uh, we will go for actions. We'll grab him. Just pull him to over our patrol car. Just so he's a bit closer. A bit safer from getting hit by cars. So we do have a lot of traffic here today. We're going to request a prison transport. So that will pull up around the corner shortly. And we'll be able to leave the scene. What's the deal with this car? Got some driver uh, in it. Now there is uh, in this game there is an MDT, so like ERLC, and that is accessible in the police car. So you can scan vehicles in front and behind, measure their speed, run their license plate, uh, run people's ID cards, all kinds of stuff. Very intricate game. Also have radar guns, all kinds of stuff. Oh, very good. So we successfully completed our first call here. Uh, so we've got. Uh, the shoplifter, I hope. I hope that was him. Uh, so we'll head up here and hopefully return the stolen items. Oh. I'm just figuring out if you click the mouse button, uh, the like the scroll... I don't know how to say it. It's like the scrolly mouse button. 
in the middle of your mouse. Uh, it makes the siren go off. Oh, mission cleared. Hey, success. Very good. Got some uh, nice reputation points there. I'm not sure what that is. I think that's like leveling up or something. Uh, we've got 10 arrests now. Zero parking tickets and zero impounded cars. Arms robbery. Oh, sick. We'll respond to that. Uh, so in the back of our trunk, we have a patrol rifle and a patrol shotgun. So we'll probably checking that out today. And we also have our uh, patrol sidearm on us, uh, which is the M1911. I presume that's what it was. And we also have the standard issue taser. So probably going in there with the assault rifle, depending on how bad the situation is. Just up here. Alright, let's go ramming speed! Get that road kill! Nah, no, I'm kidding. Alright, uh, we'll pull up here, guys. Alright, we've got two uh, suspicious suspects. Oh, holy crap! Take cover. Uh, dispatch, we are being shot at. Shots fired, shots fired. Oh my god. Let's grab our rifle out. Oh, whoops. Oh, shots fired! Ow, ow! They're shooting at my patrol car! Oh my god. Do, 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 do. Shots fired, shots fired! Dispatch, we have two suspects here. Shots fired. Uh, one male, one female. Both are armed with uh, pistols, by the look of it. Let's do a bit of a technical reload there, and we'll make our way behind the patrol car. Oh! Shots fired! We're going to put him down here. Got him! Shots fired! Shots fired! Suspect down! Suspect down! Uh, dispatch, we have two suspects down. Armed robbery, uh, shot... Shut down. Whew. Grab our patrol sidearm out in case we have to... They, nah, they don't, they don't look like they're getting up. We're going to request a transport and we're going to search the body here. So ID card, weapon, and alcoholic drink. So they were under the influence. We've also got an arms robbery. Literally right behind us probably. Uh, which we'll be responding to. I think I've clicked to respond. I think it's glitched out. Uh, we'll search the body here as well. ID card, weapon, alcoholic drink. So they're both under the influence of uh, alcohol and we've confiscated their weapons there. Perfect. Uh, so both suspects down. We've got uh, FD and AMS showing up. Their, their uh, vehicles will be pulling up any second. It's saying there's a scene here, but we've got the accident cleared up. Um, I clicked respond to that armed robbery. It doesn't say we've got any active calls, so we'll jump back in. There. Oh, there we go. Officer needs assistance. Well, we can help him out. Uh, we'll accept that call and head over there ASAP. Alright, uh, dispatch, show us responding code 3. Oh, this is the MDT I was telling you guys about. So we have uh, the CAD, uh, the speed radar, uh, the vehicle scanner, and the plate runner, kind of, our uh, archives. But we'll uh, be checking that out later. Just help this officer. He's up here somewhere. Groundwork looks absolutely amazing. Uh, it's nice to see. There is a unmarked. Uh, livery or texture. Oh, taking a bit of a shortcut here, guys, because no one wants to go around some windy road. Uh, we do have uh, two unmarked options for this Crown Vic and all the police cars and a sheriff option, as well as the police option. Now, I'm just going to the back of my car because I noticed there's an option to reload ammo, and I'm pretty low on the rifle. So if we do have to engage uh, these suspects, uh, we will have enough ammo to deal with them shortly. All right, so we've got a... Oh, ow. We've got a patrol car here. Looks like it's in a bit of a pickle. Uh, or he's afraid to get out. Oh, we got a runner. All right, dispatch, show us uh, responding. Code three, we are on scene. All right, taser out. Ma'am, just stay put there for us. We'll just have a quick chat to you. Just for some ID, please. So, Lucy. No worries, ma'am. Thank you. We'll give that back to you. Actions. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ma'am, ma'am, just stay put, please. Stay put. Uh, we're just going to quickly do a uh, search. Just make sure you don't have any items on you that are illegal. Or you're going to pull a gun on me. Happened earlier. Uh, put him in some cuffs there. Sir, can you stop? Oh! <laughs> whoops, whoops. Got to punch out his uh, window. Uh, no stress there. I'm just going to run her. So, search database. I'm going to run her details. Lucy Wade. Look her up. Alright, uh, female. Valid, valid, valid. Wanted. No. Rest zero. Alright, so she looks clean. We might actually release her there because I'm not sure she's part of this crime scene. Uh, I did notice her running, so we've got her detained. She's not under arrest at the moment. That guy's doing nothing. Bro, get out of your car. <laughs> uh, we're going to search her vehicle real quick, or I'm thinking it's her vehicle. It's definitely her vehicle. 
But I'm not sure if she's actually done anything wrong. We've got a movie ticket there. We're just quickly searching the car. Well, movie tickets aren't illegal. Last time I checked. <laughs> I will search the boot. Off-brand plastic construction bricks. So fake Lego. <laughs> I will do a quick search here. Looks all clean to me. Oh, scratch that. Semi-auto rifle. Uh, right, so we've got an unlicensed firearm. I think I'll run her uh, ID card again because I just want to make sure that it was... She, I, didn't, I don't think she had a license for the AR. Or any gun license for that matter. So I'll just check that on the MDT. Because that's a criminal offence. That's a felony. Uh, possession of a unlawful firearm. Yeah, weapon permit. Nah. We're going to lock her up. Uh, no worries. We'll jump out here and uh, put her in cuffs. Oh, she's already in cuffs. Alright, ma'am. Lucy Wade, you're under arrest. Until further notice. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do and say will be used against you in the court of law. Just get our torch hit now and pack that up. Uh, you're under arrest for possession of an unlawful firearm. Unregistered. Got our prison transport pulling up any second. So we'll let... Uh, there, there we go. We'll leave her be. Uh, they're going to run out. We've got two sheriff de deputies there. Yeah, they're going to lock her up. Very good. Uh, we'll head out back on patrol. Dispatch show us available. Available for any new calls. Lock around here. See if we get any... Check out, actually, we'll go, if we go into the MDT, oh, this guy's looking sus. Sir? No, this doesn't do anything wrong. We'll head on patrol and see if anything comes up. Just responding to a call now, we have a missing person in the vicinity uh, up here. We're looking for a Jimmy uh, Johnson there, so we're going to try to find him. Get our lights on because this is a relatively important call. We've got a missing person. Uh, we do have, according to dispatch, he is possibly armed. Uh, if we can bring him to the police station without uh, using lethal force or lethal force or non-lethal uh, force for that matter, that's going to be a success. And hopefully, we won't need to call an ambulance. Uh, I don't think the, our suspect is mentally unstable, but we will uh, just be play it cautious here. Just down here, I think. Yeah, Roger that. Uh, Roger that. Dispatch, show us uh, on scene. We've got our possible target here. Uh, he did not acknowledge our uh, siren there, so I think he's uh, in a trance, possibly, maybe high on alcohol. Let's give him our... Uh, uh, yep, we've got our suspect. Uh, not going to frisk him. Just going to get him into the patrol car. Just, Sir, we're just transporting you to the police station. You have been uh, classified as missing. Uh, we'll book you in down there and you should be good to go. Just clear everything up with the paperwork. Head to our police station. Uh, so we do have our person, Jimmy Johnston. He has been found and we do not need to use lethal or non-lethal force. So that's a success as always. Oh, run that uh, red light there because we have to get to our police station quickly. Head back on the right side of the road. Oh, in this game, uh, space bar is drift. <laughs> in emergency response, uh, space bar is get out of the, get out of the car. Yeah. And the reason I keep uh, bringing up the torch every now and then is because I click E and E's to jump out of the car in emergency response. So I've just got to adjust the controls. Alright, so we've got our suspect here. We're going to book him in. He doesn't have shoes on either. Register suspect. Ah, oh, right. So we do have to perform a uh, search just to make sure he's got nothing, uh, no contraband or anything going into the police station. Just an ID card. Well, that looks all good there. No stress. Ah, uh, we'll book him in. Just grab him again and uh, register su a suspect. Uh, Jimmy Johnston signature. Very good. Ah, oh, perfect. Mission cleared. We'll leave it there for today, folks. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, Leave feedback below. What do you guys reckon of flashing lights? Do you reckon it's better than ERLC or ER is ERLC uh, the best? Be sure to smash the subscribe button, like this video, and until next time, everyone, goodbye!